When installing a ball nut assembly in a vertical application, it can be critical to have a safety lock mechanism in the ball nut assembly to hold the load in the event of a ball screw or nut failure. An external safety nut provides the ideal backup safety feature for applications such as patient tables, stage constructions, and people bridges at the airport. To properly install the external safety nut onto a ball screw assembly, follow these steps. Hold the ball nut stationary on the ball screw shaft. Rotate the safety nut until the end face of the safety nut comes into contact with the end face of the ball nut. The purpose of this is to bring the safety thread form of the safety nut into a touch-touch condition with one of the flanks of the screw shaft's ball track. Make a temporary mark with bright colored paint in a straight line across both the safety nut and the flange of the ball nut. Then rotate the safety nut to the right approximately 10 to 15 degrees when you will feel slight resistance. Make another temporary mark on the flange of the ball nut straight across from the mark already made on the safety nut. Rotate the safety nut back to the left so that the mark on the safety nut is halfway between the two marks on the flange of the ball nut. The purpose of this is to provide approximately equal clearance on both sides of the safety nut thread form. Check that at least four of the mounting holes of the ball nut flange align with the slots in the safety nut. To complete assembly, insert mounting screws through the mounting holes on the safety nut and flange to attach to the machine mounting. It is important to check the run of the complete assembly to ensure there is no contact between the safety nut and ball screw shaft under normal running conditions. When properly installed, the external safety nut will be the ideal safety solution for vertical ball screw applications. To learn more about Thompson ball screws, visit thompsonlinear.com or contact our experienced customer support team.